MacArthur Jefferson didn't see it for the final six minutes. And right now, Baytown Sterling leads Westbrook 7 0 at the half. But Dickinson has upset Port Arthur Jefferson 20 to 6. Ball continue in the dome this afternoon. Number one ranked in the state, Port Arthur Jefferson took the ranking against Dickinson, and they lose the game and possibly the ranking. Dickinson led 10 0 at the half, then added the third quarter field goal here to up the margin to 13 to 6. Craig Stump, Jeff's outstanding quarterback, was harassed all day long. He had no time to throw on the day. Then the play that broke everybody open. Anderson takes a pitch. He cuts it back up, goes across the grain. By the time it was over, it was 54 yards. And the final score, Dickinson 20, P.A. Jeff 6. Uh, Third the weekend high school football action as the Texas State Prep Playoffs continue. Now to the public school playoffs where we had a big upset this afternoon in the Dome. Let's take a look. Number one rated Port Arthur Jefferson taking on Dickinson. What a shocker this was. In the first quarter, Vincent Wiedermeyer sweeps in for the five. Dickinson takes an early 7-0 lead. And then L.D. Morrison kicks a 37-yard field goal, upping Dickinson's advantage to 10 to nothing. Moving to the second quarter, P.A. Jeff finally gets on the board. Craig Stump of P.A. Jeff hits Patty Doyle on a 41-yard TD pass. The extra point missed, 10 to 6, Dickinson at the half. In the third quarter, everyone thought Port Arthur Jefferson would come back. Not the case, a 31-yard field goal there, ups the lead to 13 to 6. In the fourth quarter, with Dickinson ahead, 20 to 6 on a 54-yard TD, Craig Stump going for the end zone, picked off by Wiedermeyer, and Dickinson up ending P.A. Jeff, 20 to 6. Other action, the second game in the Dome. 20 to 6 over Port Arthur Jefferson, 54-yard touchdown by Anderson.